welcome back to the Red Carpet Reup, your go-to spot for all things hip-hop. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button and ring the bell to stay updated on all our latest videos. Today, we're unpacking a sizzling new feud between Rick Ross and Gilly the Kid. Let's get into it. It all started with Gilly the Kid from the podcast Million Dollars Worth of Game, calling Kendrick Lamar's recent diss track at Drake Corn on the Cob. His exact words? Well, let's just say he was not holding back on his thoughts about the track and even claimed that light-skinned guys are winning. Just heard that Kendrick Lamar diss. I fuck with Kendrick, but that shit was going on the cob, man. You know what's crazy, man? The light-skinned niggas is winning, man. Three to nothing, man. Fucking Drake up two to nothing. Motherfucking Chris Brown up one to nothing. I just take me back. I remember in the motherfucking late 80s, the motherfucking light-skinned niggas ran everything up to the late 80s. Then motherfucking Nino Brown pistol whip every light-skinned nigga in motherfucking New Jack City. Then they had it bad all the way up to motherfucking Steph Curry and Chris Brown and Clay Thompson and Drake. And now them light-skinned niggas just doing what they want, man. Y'all even let wild old light skin ass come home from jail after doing 7,300 fucking days and win. Light skin niggas just think they run the world, man. Dark skin niggas better step your game up, man. For real. Rick Ross has fired back at Gilly the Kid for criticizing Kendrick Lamar's diss track towards Drake as corny. Gilly, in a video shared on Instagram, voiced his support for Drake in the ongoing rap battle, claiming Drake is ahead in the feud. He also declared Chris Brown the winner in his feud against Quavo. Never one to shy away from a battle, Rick Ross quickly responded. His comment on Instagram, simply put, hoes hurt high. This exchange follows their previous back and forth in 2022, when Ross labeled Gilly as a fraud. But folks, that's not all. Rose didn't just stop with a comment. He took a full swing in a follow-up video. Ross delivered some serious jabs, mocking everything from private jets to alleged ghostwriting controversies surrounding Drake. He even threw in references to past disputes and surgeries, making it clear that this beef runs deep. With all this drama unfolding, one has to wonder where this leaves the artists involved and how it affects their music and public personas. Gilly, known for his outspoken nature, and Ross, who never pulls punches, seem ready to keep this feud going. But what do you think? Is there more to this than meets the eye? I want to hear from you. Drop your thoughts in the comments below. Who do you think will come out on top in this hip-hop showdown? And what do you make of the tracks and taunts being thrown around? 